All right, let's talk about abandoned checkouts. Now, abandoned checkouts is really something that we are going to cover a little bit more once we get into the uh, marketing component of our website. Now, uh, because it's on the navigation and this part of the section is going through all of the navigation pieces, I'm going to give you a quick little preview of what's in there. However, um, keep in mind that until you have abandoned checkouts, it's going to be difficult to be actually able to see what is showing up there. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to go to drafts. We're going to send a draft. So I'm going to hop over to the notes here. Going on. We are going to share this here. We're going to copy this link. We're going to paste this into our browser. Um, we may run into a problem because payment is not set up. So it is possible that it will not allow us to check out here, but we'll find out in just a moment. All right, I'm gonna enter in my email address. Enter in my account information. Sure, why not? I'm gonna to continue to shipping. It's gonna give me my shipping rates. Now, because I've entered in my email address, I should show up as an abandoned checkout. So if I go back over to the abandoned checkouts here, we can see I now have an abandoned checkout that is showing up on our, our list. Now, of course, this is a marketing piece, so abandoned checkouts, going back to marketing, is um, important. So we get this banner in here talking about marketing act, uh, automation, which we'll go over later. But uh, you can go into the abandoned checkout, you can see exactly what the customer has uh, decided to order, and you can send them a cart recovery email. So say you're on the on a line with them, they're like, hey, I had something in my cart, I don't know where it went, I don't know what's going on, my email is all messed up. You can actually go in, find their abandoned cart, send them the cart recovery email, it'll go straight to them, and away you go. Um, it will give you email statuses, so whether it's... Um, with the either email has been sent, whether they've gone and checked out, when their last activity was, um, and it will give you the recovery status. It'll tell you how uh, much has come back from there. Uh, similar to the orders page, we have our filters where we can save our views. We have uh, a couple of different, slightly different options than what we normally would have underneath orders because again, these are recovery emails. All right, I'm gonna dive more into the usage of abandoned cart emails when we go over marketing and, and how to set them all up. I just wanted to give you a quick preview of exactly what was under that page um, and how to have a look at the settings that are in there. The next thing that we're gonna start going over is we're gonna go over to products and we're gonna start adding in our own personal products.